morning. Today is Monday, July 27, 2020. I'm Dave Landry. Let's go. Well, peace out of a little bit on Friday. No big whoop. As you can see, longer term uptrend still intact. Intermediate term, eh, back in a bit of a sideways range. But uh, futures are strong pre market, so we could see a resumption of the uptrend, at least in early trading. NASDAQ composite, selling out fairly hard in here, but did find its lows and recover from them. Down about a percent on the day, but so far, 30 day EMA. Still holds, and as you can see, longer term uptrend remains intact there. Rusty, bit of a bummer, kind of stuck in a range in here, as you can see. Down about a percent and a half. Gold commodity banging out new highs with some vigor. Ditto, ditto for silver and gold stocks banging out some new highs in here, too. We are currently long the gold stocks. A lot of areas pull back, like biotech and drugs, but I wouldn't count them down and out just yet. So far, it just appears to be a pullback. So what do we do? Well, I still think it's worthwhile following along in these areas that have been trending higher. And that's what a little good little trend follower does. Any questions? Dave at DaveLander.com. I'm Dave Landry and you're